guys, you know, Joe Valentine's was two days ago. Yeah, yeah. And, uh, you know, so for, of course, for me, for, first things first. Mm-hmm. Is Valentine's a big deal? We'll start with Joyce. No. Okay, thank you very much. No, Carrie? It's, it's not a big deal. I don't think it's a big deal. One, think, maybe, okay. Putting one day where you show all the love and do all the nice things doesn't make sense to me. Doesn't mm. mean I, doesn't, I don't like those things. I love them. Mm. I love being given gifts and being taken on dates and vacations and all of those things. But I don't I believe in putting all of it in one day. Okay. It doesn't make no sense. Uh, it's filled with an unnecessary pressure for guys wanting to show show up for their babe, babes, expecting their guys to show up for them. And uh, I feel it's it's all unnecessary. So it's not a big deal. All right. Bev? As you can see, our fr- my friends are hot. <laughs> they're hurting, <laughs> they're hot. Because I'm going to have a Wednesday. Wednesday, it's going to be pressure. It's going to be pressure. Oh Everybody I have go up and attembe and a rose. You know, I had to buy roses. I had to buy myself flowers. You bought yourself no, you flowers. Have to. You have to. But I buy my myself flowers all the time. Girl, Especially shut up. I'm single. Well, exactly. Oh, single. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Let me tell you. If there's a time, if there's if there's one time being in a relationship really really counts, yeah. it's Valentine's. Because like just think, so. okay, I don't know for guys. I don't know whether guys birthdays, love. Birthdays, yeah, and birthdays. birthdays. Plus birthdays. Now imagine someone who has Valentine's ex- and right, birthdays. Same, but I know someone born on the fourteenth. Hey, pressure. Uh, to your boyfriend. Ooh, you'll see. Yeah, that one is not Why? good because mm-hmm. she, she never knows if she's being celebrated as Valentine's yeah. or oh, her yeah, birthday, oh, hey, you know. right? And and then having them is two in one. Okay, you want yeah. to your birthday is over there, your Valentine's over there, Christmas, mm-hmm. there's Easter, then Women's Day. There's Mother's Day. Yeah. Even if you don't have a kid, Do you know what I mean. I think yeah. that's why being born in September works well for both of us. But everyone is born in September. Yeah, I yeah, think. yeah, yeah. Like everyone in Kenya is oh, born in September. September. Why does it work for? See, because uh, everything is spread out. Valentine's, February, Malaysia. Christmas, another three Mali, months yeah. after. Bro, Bro, it's the same thing for people born in May. The same thing. The only thing is Labor Day. Which, and, and my mom is the only person who really knows when to give birth. <laughs> What do you mean? Gotta wait for Labor Day. Oh, because oh, that's so what that's your labor the starts labor. on Labor Day. You actually born on Labor Day. I'm born on May 9th. She her labor oh, lasted. Uh, uh, <laughs> lasted nine days. <laughs> <laughs> now you guys, Labor Day is May. Wait, 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 September. Yeah, if, if Valentine's is a big deal or not. Oh wait, let's start with let's yeah. start with our So you can see my is friends it, are hard. Yeah, is it a big deal or it not? It is for a you? big deal, but to me I prefer birthdays actually. Oh yeah? Yeah. yeah. Cause it's I'm, I'm you day. very big on birthdays. Okay. It's just me. Some for children they're clear to bus. But to be very honest, mm-hmm. I love Valentine's Day because mm-hmm. that's why I make my mula. <laughs> I, I, knew, I knew it. I knew it was about and the we'll money. We get to that very shortly. Yeah. Yeah. Very shortly. Um, I think. I think. I. I don't like. I like. I like being gifted. So, I like Valentine's. You like Valentine's for gifts. Hells yeah. So now that you don't I have love someone, gifts. how do you celebrate? You know, just, you've had... you don't get Valentine gifts just from your person. <laughs> oh, you get from other people also. <laughs> Girl. Oh, that's so cute. Me, yeah, I... that's so cute. Yeah. 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 Think, those mm-hmm. flowers, I had to say I bought myself flowers because guys were over here like, who buy you flowers? <laughs> I'm just like none of your business. Oh wow. Right? Yeah, yeah. someone's yeah. husband. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yeah. You can't be saying such things out loud. Nah, I'm kidding. I'm know, kidding. Right? You can't be saying I'm such kidding. You know me. I'm that. anti people's husbands uh-huh. until they've retired from that relationship. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Divorces. Divorce. Yeah. yeah you know, <laughs> divorces are malia malia kilam too. Like, I keep bas, saying bas, bas. I don't date married men, mm-hmm. but I can fuck a married man. Oh, oh, All oh, right. Yeah. I'm not dating you. Like we're not dating. Mm-hmm. It's just physical. Yeah. What's, and what, you feel nothing. What's the good thing in Zero it? attention. <laughs> There's no attention. Yeah. I don't want that. You go you give just want to have attention. a good time, yes, and then just yes. But like, why, no. why? Okay, why, why marry? Why a married guy? Like, because no, you know, there's I'm those. I'm only saying that because I found myself mm. in a, the best head I ever got. Wow, was, was from, from a married guy. guy. Yes, but even though I was married until later on. Yeah, yeah. okay. So I always ask first of all, are you married? Yeah, yeah. I don't do married men. Yeah, I don't get yeah, married men. Yeah, I don't. Yeah. And then he's like later on, he's like, woo, and I was like, oh, that was the best. Head. He ate my pussy so good. <laughs> I was like, you're married. Yeah, that's not cheating. <laughs> so long as there's no dick involved, yeah. I'm good. So when you found out he was married, did you continue? Yes. For, 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 for the love of tongue. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> she, she, she loves you. He was he your was, best cheater for a long time. Speaking in tongues. <laughs> so that I, I, to God, God, long time. I put to God that the, the good Lord keeps him safer and longer. Such men deserve yes. to live long. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Imagine if he died. And then who would I call? I mean, come on. Do you know, 
sad, sad thing about that, I don't think that guy shows up for his wife like that. Yeah, no, he yeah. Uh, probably not. Maybe she didn't yeah. like it. it. Yeah, it's it's how it's unfortunate a, for her. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> from the back to the front. You know what I mean? Mm. <laughs> yeah, I'm getting tingly right now. Let's go. <laughs> Yo. Okay, so speaking of All right. like, that's considered Maybe we are, a gift. Oh yeah. Do I thought you were gonna say it's considered a scene. No, 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 no. <laughs> you know what? It's a gift. Yeah. Well, surprisingly, we never had we never had sex. What? Yes. Wait, so so let me get this straight. Wait. So I'm gonna absolutely <laughs> loves eating pussy. Is he white? Yes. No, he's not he's, no, he's not he's not he's not white. Not this this, this mean, Rose over here were acting at yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Of, of all men to you, I'm right? shook. Like his pussy eating skills are so or oh, were so good. That's all he used to come and do and then he yeah. leaves. Yeah, there was no dick at all. Guys, I, is his wife feeding it. him? I don't think he's fed enough. Yeah, he's not fed. I don't think he's fed enough. Can Wait, so not? this these are those guys who like you you see, you know when you're watching a movie and you see at in the office, like some yeah. baby's just there, she's, yeah. and she's trying to type, but then she's <laughs> because there's a guy. So, yeah. Guy. Is that where you met? Actually, surprisingly, we actually met during Corona times. Oh, okay. okay. Yes. Wow. This Airbnb is of ours, actually. Hey, 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 oh, oh my god. And I, I don't know if you can catch my not his, dick, his tongue that to date. I would just give him a call just for that. And he knows his purpose. He's just coming to my house or whatever. Airbnb, you eat my pussy and we're done. Okay. Bye-bye. And he absolutely comes was he, from was that. He, no, he comes from it. Oh my God. Not touching. <laughs> Bruh, so, so, so usually like when I'm saying no, stuff wait, like not everybody Let's is see, into the so same confused. kind yeah. of things, yeah. right? Like sexually, um, to think that everybody just, you know, lala yeah. 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 out, yeah. right? And I remember yesterday we were talking and we we're saying mm-hmm. um, a lot of women actually don't come. Yeah, yeah. honestly, not have never had orgasm. Sure. Yeah. And look, this is not to 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 make men feel insufficient. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think even for men, it's similar because, for example, mm-hmm. um, I don't think it's just get into this space, and then you know. Um, I don't know which episode we're talking about yeah. somebody being blindfolded, mm. yeah, right? Yeah, I think yeah. it was with uh, Butros, right? No, no, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah someone yeah. being blindfolded, mm-hmm. right? And you getting blindfolded. Mm-hmm. So the guy the guy closing his eyes, for example, yeah. to imagine oh, somebody imagine else, else yeah. right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That yeah, is, right. Th- it means whatever is being served here in front of him, chances are it's he's, not enough yeah, and he, he wants to complement it yeah, yeah. with some imagination, mm. like maybe a teacher he thought about in school True. or, you know, and for them it's easier to do that, like going completely visual and just you know being like, oh, I'm also a very happening. visual yeah. person. I'm like really? I'm super visual. That's why you know that's why I don't like watching things that are graphic. Oh, I don't okay. like to because my mind already like I don't necessarily need uh, too much mm-hmm. to be able to you know uh-huh. my him. mind yeah. by itself. That's on the work. Like, <laughs> <laughs> oh wow! Oh, I love that. Interesting. Hey, Kerry, I know you had something mm. to say about the giving head and <laughs> leaving. No, it's just I wanted to know like yeah. he'd 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 not would he be dressed? He's not dressed, but you said he came from it. Yeah, so yeah, he, definitely. He, not he came, comes mm. <laughs> continuous. Com- um, <laughs> <laughs> like yeah, even if he's undressed, mm-hmm. he just gets satisfaction from eating my pussy. Yeah. Guy. Yeah. I know he usually I, like, even I was like, ooh. Like I thought I need something to give you after you've yeah, eaten me out. Yeah, yeah. Because, because I, had, custom. I think I had about 17 mini orgasms. There were yeah. so many. I was like, what the hell is that many? It was my first time. It's called the time. Jesus I'm looking at the time. I'm like, oh my God. Kuna kafi. Oh my God. Kuna kafi. Like, in the, my lizard. Like, kuna kafi. But let's go on. You know, you know the 7 p.m. coffee we had? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Time. Oh, those are and the times now. It was that time, 7 to 4. Yeah, those ones. Girl, yeah. I know what the fuck coffee is. You said 17 mini what? Orgasms. Girl. There were so hey. many. Hey. I couldn't even count. There's someone who's watching the TV right now saying, I come like a man. I come quite quick. It doesn't take much. It doesn't take much for you too. So long as you eat my pussy good, I'm good. Oh my gosh. But not everyone can eat pussy. Facts. Mm, mm, So now, let's now go back to the conversation me and Kwambox were having. And I was telling her the reason why a lot of, I feel, uh, the reason why a lot of women don't get um, satisfaction from sex, like the penetration, you know, sex is because we are not able or rather we don't feel comfortable enough to vocalize what we want. Yeah. Yeah. Because I keep telling people, I've always told all my friends, male friends, female friends, we all have the exact same anatomy, anatomy. as women. Mm. But what makes us tick is uniquely, as men, di- like sorry. uniquely yeah. different. Like mm. you'll never, you see like um, 
like the way they talk about like every snowflake is different think of women like that yeah. so guys i think i think it's the same for for even 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 guys no even but guys, guys it's no guys it's easier for them to get there like they can literally just close their eyes and be like oh yeah i'm getting some let's oh. come finish you get what i mean i think that's what no. i think i think that's what babes it's, think yeah, yeah no it's no, no it's, a, it's, it, it, it's i'm not saying it doesn't happen but mm. the majority mm. of right. times that it's easier for men to come it's very high you can't compare it to women. I'll tell you one Just thing. Just because it it does happen with guys, it's not as high in one, percentage one, as women. One uh-huh. major difference in guys, yeah. uh, I think, is uh, there's givers and there's receivers. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So if you meet a guy who's a giver, mm-hmm. they'd want to show you yeah, yeah, uh, they what, mm-hmm. yeah, what they can do. But oh, now yeah. the thing is, uh, the uh, most most givers would not want to listen and mm-hmm. not want to do what the other person wants. Yeah, the other person wants. Oh, yeah. wants. receive. Not yeah. all givers are receivers. Yeah. Is, yeah. Ah, okay. Yeah. Yeah. And, no, it's and, not and, weird. And most and most most receivers, uh, generally, not that I know a lot, but I think uh, generally mm-hmm. would would act like how what you're saying babes do mm-hmm. is you you don't want to vocalize. You don't want to yeah, say yeah, yeah. how you'd like to receive it. Yeah, yeah. Ah. So you end up, you, you just end up doing the same thing mm-hmm. with every other different person up until you get to that one person who ah, who's giving you. who's giving yeah, yeah. the then you start saying yeah but you are so right okay, yeah, let okay, me tell you yeah, something yeah, yeah, yeah. let me okay, tell you something okay, can i tell you okay, something okay, funny okay. yeah Makes sense. so where i mean where to to subscribe to subscribe hey subscribe subs hey mbaka na sino kusema ji hey ebu gonga hapo sub ebu notify yourself hey subscribe when I was in campus, I realized that uh, f- there's a friend I had and I honestly, you know, because in campus, what do you know? Mm. Like, what do you know? Mm. You know, yeah. you go on a date and you're like, oh, God, it's good. <laughs> <laughs> For real? <laughs> it was good? Yeah. yeah. What did you do? Ah, I came. Especially because you're not even and taught even what as she's, is. In yeah. fact, as, even as she's explaining to you what happened, mm. she's not talking about like if there was an end result. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right? She's, she's just like, we did it. Mm. Right? Yeah. We did it. Yeah. And then now, because these girls we've grown up together now, mm. right? Now you have the conversations like, "Yo, girl, you know me. I never, I never had orgasm." But I'm like, "But you used to go on you those days and used to say all these things." Yeah. And then the girl tells you, "Yeah, I, I didn't know what we were doing. Exactly. I literally <laughs> didn't know." And you know, you're you're just excited. You're with this guy, mm-hmm. you know, and he's he's paying your attention, and you you know you're dating. Yeah. So it's just the right next step yeah. is to give him the goodies. Yeah, yeah. Now when you're starting to now really vocalize, like now you're in a relationship, maybe you're married mm-hmm. and now you're trying, now the big challenge they have is that I've been doing this nonsense with this guy. Yeah. And now I've realized that there's more out there, yeah. right? For, for her, she won't tell me how she, she discovered mm, yeah. out there and she's in a marriage. Just, yeah, yeah. But now to vocalize this and introduce new things into this marriage. Hey, hey. How, how do you explain that? <laughs> so you put up people are actually, like not in a bad way, yeah. Yeah. but is it worth leaving this situation mm. because you are with a person who's so rigid? Mm. Yeah. Rigid, and I'm not talking about strength. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. But I, I feel like I, I, one of the most ignored conversations, obviously, is what happens in the bedroom because yeah. like you said, guys will go in with what they've been doing for years. They're like, yeah, it works. She had a great time. Mm. They don't know if it was real or not. No, but even but even the girl, the yeah, girls have a big part to yeah, play because yeah, yeah, you're yeah, the one the telling this guy, oh my God, yeah, yeah, yeah. you're making weird, you're making weird yeah, crazy yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah. Advice, yeah. You know what I'm saying? I don't fake orgasms. I've never faked an orgasm. Even in the beginning. No, 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 oh no. Oh no. my god. If it's shit, it's shit. <laughs> you know, what the fuck are you doing? What the hell? See, Evo. Me will tell you. Because, listen, you know the, all these memes that say, oh my god, Ati, Lazima. Yeah. Uh, about coming, yeah. like it's on you. Yeah, it's actually on you. It's your responsibility. You have to tell them. Yeah. I work on my orgasm. You have I to tell them. My cam. If you don't, you didn't come. That's your fucking. Problem. That's on you. <laughs> I've come. And if I didn't come, I'll tell you that I didn't come. Yeah. I'll take my vibrator. Mm-hmm. And do my. <gasps> it's a problem. Thank you very much. And that's why we, I wanted. That. This is this is why we invited her because Ooh. there is an etiquette around sex toys. Yeah. First, are sex toys legal in Kenya? Can I answer that question yes or no? Because let me just say uh-huh. it's restricted. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's yeah. restricted. Let me okay. <laughs> because all right, <laughs> we've, moved, we've, moved, Thank we've moved past that. Yeah. Right? But when you look at this table, yeah. right? And uh Gilly can show you what's on this table. Like yeah. I just saw this hog tea set, mm. right? First things first. Yeah, There's yeah. what she's talked about. Um hog bringing, time. bringing sex toys, yeah. right? I think in 2024, you are bound. I think we've had conversations about, you know, another, another panga, panga yeah, yeah. right? Someone <laughs> and sheafing this yeah. 
<laughs> she'll just steal her in the middle of sex and yeah. you're just like Huh? You, you didn't have this conversation yeah you didn't tell right? me right yeah. if a guy just comes to your house and he says babe I've got balls yeah mm-hmm. and he's coming with his balls <laughs> and he wants to stash them up your dabs and, and you're just like, like I don't know about these things yeah. what the hell are you talking about yeah. right so what 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 would you advise someone is the right etiquette Kerry has seen this and he mm-hmm. wants to take it to some babe now yeah. and say I want to tie Be you like, up let's try. how do you bring this without offending because remember we live in a society yeah. that feels yeah. these things for a lot of people even who are watching yeah. they're just like oh my God, she's touching it, yeah. 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 First things first, to me, toys are are not there to replace a man or whatever, or Mm -hmm. a partner. To me, toys are just there to aid. They're assistance to getting there and for spicing things up. For example, Mm -hmm. what you're holding right now, Mm -hmm. this is just not missionary style because we're so used to just doing one particular (laughs) position. So this particular hog hog, hog tie, for example, Mm -hmm. once you're tied up, it gives you different ways to use it. Fuck. Basically. (laughs) Different positions, and I absolutely love when. But m- m- your question, to be very honest, is I normally when you're dating someone, the f- the beginning, mm-hmm. just be honest with them. Yeah. Like I love this, I love mm-hmm. this. Come back, I I ende I ende. No, you'll find because, someone else. Yeah. Because yeah. yeah. introducing toys to a relationship, to a marriage, whatever, is mm-hmm. really difficult. I can imagine. And, and more so once you're already dating or already married. Yeah. yeah. They're like, ooh. And look on yes. Oh no, no. Yeah. Yeah. Carrie, how would you feel? Yeah. How would you feel yeah. like if your babe came and she has look, she has this, yeah. she'll tell oh, us yeah, what this is. Yeah. 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 yeah, this is like shut up, shut, shut people. up, shut <laughs> up. <laughs> right. And then there's this one. She, and then and then this and she told you, yeah, I this got the hog tie set, I'm on my way. Yeah. yeah. Right? You know, I'm, 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 I'm different. Thing. I'd actually want to to try, try to try them out. Of course, I've got my limits. And what is your limit? Anything up my diabs. Okay. Yeah, that, Do you know, I, okay. I, even as I was asking, yeah. you already knew. Yeah. Every, guy's, every guy's answer. Is it is it because I've said it before or no, it's every guy's answer. But right. The prostate is in the ass, in the diabs. Yeah, yeah that's where that. the tongue comes G-spot. way much better when the a finger is up his ass. Because now, the I prostate. Think, I, I still think I still think I Okay, I try there. it. Try it. <laughs> no, I get that. Stop, stop fighting. Just, you know, you know, think maybe I get you've there. never arrived. Really well. <laughs> right. Yeah. But uh <laughs> I'm quite different because I'm open to actually trying and playing with toys okay. because it's it's not something I've hidden before. Mm-hmm. I constantly say it. Yeah. Even as Joyce today, I was saying yeah, I want. I was like, I, I want, want this one. I want no, no, no. This, this, this one is your. This one is. <laughs> no, actually, actually, no, it's not this. I think this one is for campus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 For I, campus. Actually, yeah. I don't think I can open it, but yeah, Okundani, there's a pocket. There's a pocket for yeah. you. Yeah, there's a pocket. <laughs> You Some like female anatomy. Okay. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So, so before, before, I mean. <laughs> no, let me, let me, let me finish. Don't open it. No, no, finish, 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 finish up. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I'm open to doing it. Mm-hmm. And I think the perception and the problem is what you've just said, mm-hmm. uh, where someone would ask, yeah. but now the main thing about <laughs> getting there, like having an orgasm in yeah. sex, it's, uh, most of the time is through experiences. If you've ever gotten there before in <laughs> one way <laughs> or another. No, that's, that's, that's I'm trying to teach you off. A lot of play with. So you are open to it. Uh, Fantastic. One th- no, let me finish. Okay. I'm saying mm-hmm. uh, most people are scared to talk Introduce, about yeah. what is good for them because yeah. they know it's something that someone did it to you first mm. or you did to someone first mm. and you enjoyed it. So mm. now that fear of speaking about it is a problem. And I think like, I mean, if you're adults in a room and you're about to like share a life together, man, just go on and say, this is what you like doing. Yeah. This is what you like being done to you. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yo, you guys, have you ever told someone some freaky shit and then they, they looked at you sideways? Yeah. <laughs> like, wow. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I've told someone some freaky shit and mm. they never spoke to me again. Ah. Oh. No, no, you know, it does happen. Like, now yeah. I'm so tempted to hear what you told him. Yeah, Not maybe. here. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Not is it is it here safe? Is it safe? Ebu, tell is us. Safe? What did you tell them? What did, what is this? Someone can be told. Paka, they run away. Is it safe? Just tell us. We'll it's, we'll know whether to edit it or not. It's it's safe, but I don't know uh, whether you. Ebu, tell us. Ebu, tell us. How can we judge you now? <laughs> it's to do with me telling someone where I want them to sit. On your face. That's I didn't say wrong. that. It has to be your face. Where else do you want them to sit? Yeah. On your finger. I don't know. On your <laughs> laps. It has to be your face. Yeah. Because to saying... me, mine was my ex. Uh, because my my. Wait, 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 hold on. Oh, sorry, and, and and they got upset. They ran away. Yeah, yeah, why? Yeah. 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 Why? Yeah
Just a yen, Mimi Siku. I mean, the homecomers in my career, like, on a tiny quay, Mada She wrote. No, obviously, he, she, he was not scared, so that was not the issue. So she was the issue. Yeah. yeah. The other person, not, not you. Yeah. yeah. I, but, think, I think the person was too conservative. Shy. Yeah. Okay. But and I think also, you know, not, two missionaries. Yeah, people's, bodies, people's bodies. People's well, bodies. People's best. bodies. Like, even things like head. Mm-hmm. I feel like, who was, was I having a, No, I was talking to someone today. Mm-hmm. They were talking about how women's bodies are generally. She said women's bodies generally smell good. Mm-hmm. And I had a side side eye. Give her a bombastic side eye. <laughs> Which, because I think, I think because um, there is hygiene mm-hmm. standards, yeah. right? And a lot of people are now starting to find out how to take care of themselves, yeah. right? Yeah. Like, you, you know that maybe you, you, you're not too confident in how your body smells, mm. right? And so there are some things you wouldn't be open to. Okay. Right. So for example, if someone tells you, hey, head, you're just like, nah, it's it's not clean. Yeah. You know, and you're describing your own body. Yeah. Right. So in my head, I'm just saying, it's not clean. What do you mean? It's your body. <laughs> right? Do you need a shower? Yeah. Do you need to a body? Up. Right? <laughs> I had some chick, some chick I was saying oh, years and years ago. Uh-huh. And her, I'm sorry, but her pussy stank. <laughs> was it because of what she was eating? What was it? Uh, Sometimes it goes without that, to be very honest. Because what you eat it comes out from exactly. the as well. You yeah. know, too, too much garlic, too much onion. Yeah, 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 it goes back. Yeah. You don't take care of yourself. You don't shower well. Mm. You don't, don't even eat hygiene, fruits, man. fruits yeah. peeing after sex. So many things right. like that. Oh, but her pussy stank. So I kind of understand what you mean. Yeah. She, was, she, was, she ate my pussy good, right? Mm-hmm. But when it was my time, I was like, oh. And you know how they always push your head like, I'm sorry. Yeah. <laughs> You're like, no, thank you. It's like, so you miss me so with now, that. So now in that situation, how do you tell someone? You, if, okay, as a guy, how do you tell a babe like, <laughs> Karen, so Karen, no, you can relate to this nice. story. Yeah. yeah, most definitely. And uh, that's one of the things that would actually make a guy not want to go through with sex. Yeah. And as a guy, you don't really... Finding the words to say it. I know it's hard. It's right? hard, eh? Yeah. And you just say. But you, you can't. Can you? Like, can you tell? Can you tell a babe that you're not yes. No, no. Especially the. You the can't tell the babe, but you can tell. tell. You can smell. Yeah. 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 As guys, guys okay. smell, and yeah. mm. it's not in your position to you know, go and tell you. Baby. But, but if it's, uh, I've had a situation where <laughs> it it wasn't during sex. Mm-hmm. It's you know how you could just. There's instances that you can smell even way before. Like, let's mm. say you're probably in the office or at mm. a club. Or yeah. Whatnot. Yeah. yeah. Kawif. Mm. And you're like, wait. So if you have a babe friend yeah. who's like friends with that person, that's going to be like, hey, Joyce. Maybe Ebu. try and tell her. Yeah, go yeah. and tell Nani. Man. Yeah. That her pussy smelling. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 You, how would you tell someone, Kwambo? It's you not my goddamn business. Tell- but thing, your coochie, your coochie is not. Yeah, yeah but, but guys, let me tell you. What if you're in the same office? You're, forget, office? Yeah. you're talking about office. Yeah. Guys, I talk about this shit, but guys think I'm insane, yeah. right? When it comes to vaginal health, yeah. right? And what yeah. usually, it's not even just vagina because mm. ass is also another whole aspect, it's right? True. A lot of people don't know how to take care of just down there, yeah. right? So you're sitting in a matatu. Me, I used to, this is what I used to experience when I was doing matatu culture, yeah, yeah, yeah. right? Someone is still over there in the corner. Me, I'm still over there. She has to pass or he has to mm. pass over here. And I'm, I can smell diabs. Yeah. Why am I smelling your diabs? Yeah. <laughs> Where the Why? fuck am I smelling your ass? Yeah. Right? Yeah. And then you're going to tell me, at hey, hey, and you haven't washed your ass. Right? You're a grown man. Father. <laughs> you can't wash your ass. Man. Right? Ulisaha, uliwasha kila pali, ukawasha maskyo, kapaka wafanya. Right? Ukasa ukufanya hivi. Kupitisha tu sabuni kwa haga kangu. No, but do you know, I actually recently <laughs> found that out. Right. Yeah. I recently found that out that like, guy, or not all guys, but like guys don't know how to wash their ass. Yeah. Because you know, know for us, it the, comes so naturally. You sit so. on a seat yeah. and you can yeah. smell yeah. someone's yeah. ass. Yeah. What is that? Yeah. What is it? Because you know, for us, it comes very naturally. I mean, when you're washing down there, it's there. You see, know? see, that's for what, guys, see, I started with guys. See, see, I started with guys. See, I started with guys. Yeah. See, now I'm fast forwarding to babes. So relax. Don't be too harsh on guys. Because it's, okay. The kiboko is coming. Yeah, it's still coming, mm. but I'm saying it's odd because that's all you have to do. It's not odd there. because Something's babes who know this shit yeah. don't wash. Why? Because there are people who forget that how you're supposed you to wash. No, but it's not also forgetting. Remember, eh. I want to ask you, ladies, eh. how eh. did you know about taking care of yourself, especially from down your, there? From your mom. But from they school. didn't have 
ample information. Yeah, they did. Over the years, you have learned a learned few other things, exactly right? And so you knew that, for example, maybe your aunt taught you yeah. to wash with soap, exactly. right? But now you learned You're that... You're not supposed to wash with not soap. not supposed to wash with soap. Yeah. And you, yeah. you know, mm. but there are a lot of babes who don't know that. True. So they wash with soap, mm. right? Which messes the pH, pH Which for down there. Smell worse. The next thing yeah. is just like, sis... Mm. Are you dying? Yeah. Right? <laughs> but she don't know. Yo, she don't know. That's true. And so now, for her, now I want to explain to you mm. that scenario you mm. are in, right? Mm. If you've constantly been, this is a space that you you can't trust. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Right? You mm. see, her, she has the confidence. Mm. As we're sitting there, we have the confidence because mm. you know what products you're using. Exactly. You know how to take care of the space. Mm. You know how to, you know. So you're confident that in any event that I know how I smell. I know how I feel. I know how I, but then you have a babe who probably doesn't. It's a patapotea. She doesn't know how to handle the pH mm, for down yeah. there. Right? And then you tell her, yeah, yeah, yeah. I want to go down on you. She's like, she didn't even, she even quote me. for you the Bible. That was me. She quote for you the Bible. She'd be like, no. As in our religion, we don't do that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right? What she's basically trying to tell you, if you can keep your nose the farthest away from her, <laughs> the piece, the better. it should be best. Oh, no. Right? Because even for her, mm -hmm. she can smell it. Yeah. So even that person, wow. she knows she smells like that. She just doesn't know how to deal with she it. She was pushing yeah. me my head down her. I'm like, <laughs> yes. She wants to be like, if I've been dealing with this shit, bitch, you're going to deal with it. Huh? Nah. <laughs> so is it that they're unaware? There are those who are unaware that they Some have an order? Are, I, don't, I think it's, not you all. don't know what yeah. to do about it. No, have you ever there's been... There's the Google, man. Google uh, has all the answers. Oh, so you think everybody's just Googling about their vagina? There's, 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 this I, place, I there's this place on uh, Outering Roads mm -hmm. where I think there's a sewage that Peter's. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, so but you you see a sewage? No, listen, listen, oh, listen, 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 listen. There are houses uh -huh. and people that live there. Uh -huh. So there's always a saying, uh, th those people that live there, mm. they've they've been so used to that smell up until... Oh, it doesn't bother them. Yeah, it doesn't bother them. It's natural. There we go. So I think... You get it. Right, 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 right. You get it. They, they've they're gotten used to it. Now you get it. I get it. You oh, are getting okay. it and don't forget about it. Yeah, but yeah. now also, guys, this is for you in the comment section. Hygiene. How do you tell someone that they, it doesn't have to be vaginal health, mm. like just general, if even, someone has a general even order, breath, even your breath. how do you go about it? But yeah. now we are talking about the mouth for down there. Yeah, now but, it's <laughs> but it's a general question, guys. Please the tell me. Hot breath. Yeah. Yeah. Hot yeah. bad yeah. breath. Who can breath up in me? Chapa. Who can down? Chapa. But, but <laughs> me, I think the guys who the guys who've really let these people down mm -hmm. is their friends. Because yeah. I think as girlfriends, yeah. you can be able yeah, to you can yeah. tell. Yeah. Me, I, I have such a strong sense of smell. Yeah, yeah me too. I will avoid you that like the Blake. You would tell them? I will avoid you like the place. As a friend? I will you would avoid. tell them? Which friend of mine has a smelly kuchi? That's true. I was about to say even me, I'm not around people who what are you talking? If if like if 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 God forbid that's the situation we're yeah, in, yeah, I'ma yeah. tell you. Exactly. Even yeah. if you're the lady who cleans my house or your I will tell you, really? sis, really? why don't, don't you that? try a pan sita? No, wow. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I like to Okay. Because nah. we go like this. Like, you know, okay. 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 Something. Yeah. Something. Yeah. 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 I mean, I'll tell you. <laughs> I look at someone. Okay. Well, Anyways. Oh, God. When I look at the sex toys and... Ooh la la. If you're enjoying this episode like I know you are, don't pretend, don't pretend. This is a safe space. So do this, yeah? Click that button. These products are becoming very, very... They're becoming Popular. part of... of uh, sex life. Sex life. Yeah. yeah. In fact, I dare say that for the next generation, mm -hmm. like, I think Gen Z, mm -hmm. this is Ooh. a reality they'll have to face. 100%. Right? But I'll tell you an example. Mm -hmm. A friend of mine was uh, doing the do, right? Yeah. <laughs> or as you should say, fucking. Yeah, it's right? fucking. <laughs> and then her partner just brings a sex toy in the midst of sex. Mm -hmm. Right? In the midst. <laughs> like in the middle of getting it on, another partner. Yeah, and she mm -hmm. got offended. Okay. And not he, she. She got offended. Oh. Because it wasn't a it wasn't a I mean when when you talk about sex toys, everybody thinks dildos. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Just the one. Yeah. yeah. So there's different. Like yeah. you're in the middle of sex dress, and then someone starts tying you up. Yeah. <laughs> Chomo has his handcuffs. He has yeah. a whip. What? What? <laughs> <laughs> and femicide. I don't know, you you know, what the fuck? 
man. <laughs> like you wanna kill me. Bro, yeah. Like I think there's a conversation that needs to go yeah, down, yeah. right? Yeah. So this is clearly a reality, mm-hmm. right? Mm-hmm. What would be a good place to start? Because I think that's where the the problems. The is, yeah. yeah. Where starting. where do you start? How do you yeah. identify? Okay, I think I might need a sex toy, mm. right? How do I? Or I or want to try out a sex yeah, toy. Which one do I start? Do I start, try, do yeah, I start yeah. the NLB? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, initially when I was doing this, I thought toys were just for single people. Mm-hmm. Right. And this is, I think I'm on my 11th year this year. Nice. Like, I always thought that it was just for single people because, you know, Duh. you're yeah, married. Yeah, yeah, why yeah, do, yeah. Why yeah. do you need toys? You and, have a deal though. Yeah. <laughs> and that's what I want, right? A life one. <laughs> a life one. So I, and then I realized, surprisingly, I think the first or second year of my business, mm. most of my clients were actually married Wow. Couples and the, it was the men who were, by, who were introducing toys to their wives. Interesting. I didn't even know that because I thought the, the women that like, would be know, more interested. Yeah. So so I'm not men. weird. You're not. You're weird. not weird. <laughs> yeah. no, no, no. I don't call it weird. It's just exploring. <laughs> yeah. And like I mentioned, like to me, toys are aiding your mm. sex life. Mm-hmm. Not there to replace. Mm-hmm. But how do you introduce toys? Yeah. To your partner. Mm-hmm. Because again, if you're dating first, a second year, mm-hmm. you love something. 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 You know, some just spice. To add some, some spice in yeah. it. <laughs> <laughs> some oof. Oof. <laughs> you love it. It's oof. You can yeah. add something. Yeah. Didn't and mean. I realized, because I had so many male male clients mm-hmm. who wanted to buy toys for their wives or their girlfriends, mm-hmm. but they didn't know what, what to, to start. What to buy, yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. No, no, no. no, no yeah, yeah. How to okay. Do, how, wait, how wait, wait. How to your girlfriend, oh, babes, I feel, I think you need a rabbit vibrator. Like, how to tell your, your wife, yeah, but like, it's just so why do they want for the to buy for yeah, because the average guy. Are, hold oh, on, okay, okay. even porn as well. Porn is a very big factor as oh. well. But here's my question, right? Okay. Just mm-hmm. going back to that, men and husbands, yeah. boyfriends and and husbands yeah. buying their wives sex toys, yeah. because you'd think the average person when you talk about sex toys, they're like it's replacing them, yeah. it's emasculating. Yeah, yeah, yeah. These are the words mm. that are being used. Mm. Um, to think a man is going out to buy his babe a vibrator, which is not helping him. Mm. How does that work? What in his mind? What is he thinking? I what think is he trying to achieve? To him, most of most of this, okay, the, the ones buying the toy for mm. the wife. Yes. yes. First of all, most of them have seen it on porn. <laughs> oh, they're like, oh, I want to try yeah. that. Yeah. Or maybe they've seen it on my on my Instagram page or something. Mm-hmm. But I've I've noticed those married men just want to see the women come. Oh wow! Because most of those men, not all, but yeah. some of them haven't made the women come. Ah. Oh. Oh, because damn. a vibrator is a guaranteed 35 seconds maximum orgasm. In 35 seconds, ni me come. What? 35 seconds. Eh, eh, you know why Joyce is saying what loudly like that? <laughs> <laughs> what, what she meant to say is hallelujah, yes. I can confirm that word. No, I didn't. <laughs> Shut up. No, you know I'm it quiet. was that. <laughs> Corona time. <laughs> but when COVID was there, is when mm. I realized that married men, mm-hmm. they all had girlfriends, campus chicks and all that. Yeah. Mm. And I realized that most of these men were advanced for actually buying toys for their mpangos. Or to keep them entertained. Yeah, because now you're not has- your wife at home. Yeah. I mean, you're locked. You're yeah. not allowed to you're like me. <laughs> and you realize, because oh Coro made you realize that, oh my God, Oh, my, 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 my wife actually loves blue. I didn't even know she likes blue. Because yeah, I, you actually get to know her. Because I'm older. Yeah, all the time. time. Again, ay, starting. Ay, 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 but ay, so ay, these married ay, men ay, are those who are not buying toys for their girlfriends because mm. they're like, hey, by the way, my girlfriend in campus or whatever yeah. wants some dick. Yeah, and I can't. I love my wife now. I prefer my wife now. You know what I mean? Yeah, 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 so yeah, these married yeah, men are yeah, actually yeah, buying yeah, no toys for their girlfriends. But it was mostly just to keep them, you know, Busy. busy, busy, and entertained. As yet, they go. As part of the real and sex story. That's what story. they realize. Actually, most mm-hmm. m- most men then were like, "Oh my god, I actually mm-hmm. prefer my girlfriend, my wife, or whatever, having a toy yeah. than not having a toy because I rather have a vibrator than have a heart with a with another boy. guy. Yeah, or you or know, whatever, a clandestine yeah, somewhere, yeah, yeah, yeah. a cabinetin somewhere. Mm-hmm. So men realize that actually toys are and actually helping. helping my, my Is this marriage. part of the nini? That's rope. Oh, that's, that's, that's a rope. Being See, that's what for being. Oh. Tied up. For just tying someone up. <laughs> yeah. This is the most, the best experience to me, eh. more than a toy that I experienced a couple of months ago. Why? 
And then now, what's so do exciting you also, about do you also, it? Do you also teach like people how to like tie proper knots? I know so nothing about ama chokes. Ama so, okay. so, 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 so tell us, tell us about your experience. Yeah, well, it's such a good experience. Um, so the, her lady is called the Pleasure Missionary, mm-hmm. uh, American. Uh, we're here for the the sex. Oh, what if they're for Nani's podcast? Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. So the 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 what's what's the name? The spread. The spread. The spread. Yeah. And. I'm spreading. telling you, I've never been tied up that good. My first time, and I was like, what like is just happening being tied to up me? was exciting, or what happened while you were being tied up? I came. By being tied up? Yes. Without being touched? Yes. Stop it. I had orgasms that I've never had in my life, and I was just... What? I don't have the rest to date. I think... I don't know what it was. <laughs> it shocked. Even I was shocked. I was up, just wrote, just being tied, tied up. Tied up. It was the best feeling ever. I don't that know. I don't know. Is yeah. So insane. my point is, so I'm not just for what people think. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. To me, it was just a healing process. I was healed. Yeah. Speaking of which, let's go back to the beginning. Oh, yeah, yeah, Eleven yeah. years ago. Woo. No, no. Actually, actually, before you get to that, yeah. yeah. When you say, you see, when you describe this, what what is this? This is a cock ring. Okay. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I thought, I thought yeah. this was the first thing. Which was like, you know, a key holder or something. Nah. Yeah. It's a kinda, cock ring. Kinda. So this is a cock ring. Yeah. So for the guy. How does that work again? So there are two ways. Mm-hmm. So this is either for preventing premature ejaculation. Okay. Because, you know, it's tight. All so right. in, in a kushika, it makes you on your, yeah. Aha. Uh-huh. Last longer. Aha. Uh-huh. Right. And the good thing, we can put it on, it, it's also very amazing on the cheek. So once the guy wears it on him, uh-huh. so this is basically rubbing on her cleat. So when you're thrusting her and it's vibrating, uh, I don't know if the microphone can hear that. Yeah. It can. Uh. Yeah. Okay. So yeah. She reminds so me of my is, Nokia 33. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good old servant. Yeah, so it's basically, a, a, okay, so cock rings were invented for men not to come quick. Yeah, but they found other Which, purposes. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. But here's my question, yeah. right? So let's go back to the one for being tied up, right? I I, I can't switch Pleasure this off. And- <laughs> I can't switch this off. Just ten vibrations, so just long press. There you go. Ten. Uh-huh. One, ten. two, three, four, five. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah you meet a girl the next day one. in the office. Is big. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no wondering, bro. I I can't take it off. After, <laughs> no, no, after no, shock. Even after if you move it, after, after shock. <laughs> so what was your question? What's your question? Yeah. <laughs> so, combo is kind of for ten hours because of that day. He kit your taiwa, right? Oh, the rope. Uh-huh. Yeah. What so he said, this? "This is the best tying that you've there. ever had, right?" Uh-huh. I mean, if you look in Kenya, for example, yeah. we, for a lot of people, they look at this as a violent act, mm. Oh. Mm. and for for a lot of people, or suicide. You know, yeah. a violent act. If mm-hmm. like I, my partner ties me up and I say, oh, my partner oh. tied me up. Yeah, they right? think, oh my God. Oh. Yeah, 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 super violent, right. right? In all this, I think consent is, oh, is key. Oh, like, like, When I look at this hook tie yeah, set and you, you're you dealing with someone who has control issues. Yeah, yeah they won't like that. This mm-hmm. is going to, no, they are the ones who are putting this on you. Oh. I mean, the so level they of- they love it. Yeah. yeah. So I, I clearly think that these things need a level of consent. Oh my God. And communication before mm. you start. Yeah. Any, like every toy that you introduce to your partner, anything you get, any sex toy or any aid, like yeah. an aid, sex aid, mm. you should always talk to your partner first. Okay. Because how else are you meant to know that your partner loves this and that? Exactly. Like let them know how it works. Yeah. And then I just love how you're married for like 10 years, seven years, your sex is boring. Yeah. And then it gets you introduce, boring in yeah. They're like, woohoo. I've got clients telling me, oh my God, Bev, you saved my marriage. Wow. Yeah, because of toys. Really? Yeah. And I was like, sorry, what? Because to me, I was looking for money initially, 11 years ago, just yeah, for money. Yeah. Until you realize people are telling you, oh my God, like for, for, for the first time I had an orgasm in my life. Dying. For the first time I, I, first time I could squat. Dying. Like squatting is a very big deal now. It's becoming, it's becoming very more commercialized, mm-hmm. really. Mm-hmm. But women have come the first, not come had an a uh, squat yeah. because squatting, orgasming, and coming are very different. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. Um, in an African society, right? And I and I ask this knowing very well what I'm going to introduce next. But yeah. in an African society, these things are looked down, frowned upon, mm-hmm. right? Really? Why do you think we frown upon these things? Because what you're describing se- seems like 
the you know, woman. No, it's not even that. It just sounds like it's good. Why isn't everybody on it, right? Mm. But of course, there's a resistance. And Control. stigma. And Control. even Control. we spoke yeah. about even the fact that here it is restricted, yeah, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. So why, 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 if there's all this pleasure, mm-hmm. what mm-hmm. would be the problem? The problem is it's the men. <laughs> okay. I'm sorry. Yeah. They feel like they're being replaced. Mm-hmm. Like I've mentioned, you can have an orgasm in 20 seconds. Yeah. Then a guy is just there, like hey. for like. Uh, so no, I, I can't be. I can't be. So so to <laughs> this man. <laughs> Come on. So no. so, yeah. so so to this man, it's yeah. either you have a twenty-five second orgasm or no orgasm at all. At all. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> exactly. Because so I want to control so you. Because I'm. I have the uh, re- 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 real. Yeah. 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 Why yeah. do you want to replace this with this? Yeah. With plastic. Because it's yeah. this plastic and you know silicon. Thing. When you're saying that these yeah. things are bringing relationships together mm. for somebody. I know Man. people who these things have ended relationships. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. Oh, okay. it's either, it's yeah. Either, I know people yeah. who like a guy is just like, she brought a dildo into, the, I found a dildo in the house. Yeah. What is she doing with a dildo? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> And then, you know, also, I think for the longest time, yeah. female pleasure has been frowned upon. Yeah. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah. Like, you're working just to about. give birth, keep keep it pushing. You're that's not supposed it. to enjoy this keep thing. Yeah. So I think that's also <laughs> literally keep it and pushing. And that's even the FGM came up because yeah. FGM was mm. basically there to control women. Exactly. Because FGM, once your clit is cut and the, the, there's no pleasure. Shana, shana, mm. no pleasure, it's just for the man. And Imagine. it's so painful for the woman. Aki. Right? They even die, and man. We have wh- why do we have clitorises as women? See for pleasure. Nothing else. Yeah. It has basically more than eight no thousand nerve endings just for pleasure. Yeah. The clit is there to make you come and enjoy basically. sex. Yeah. So once the men or whoever came and they're cutting it off, because apparently you're gonna get promiscuous if you have a clit because you're gonna Jesus you know what I mean? Yes. You're gonna feel it. It was a male thing, just like how even in Saudi Arabia you couldn't even drive as a woman because yeah. of vibration on the car. Surely, no are you serious? Way. That's the reason. Yeah, no. You're lying. That's what I meant. That can't be the reason. What? No and way. Then now, and then now I go back and do this in Kenya and do this, my damn man, do this. Impressions. <laughs> <laughs> like, you know, like, oh, but I'm sorry. Like, if you see killer, you see me while you're in your own But no, people do this. What's my impressions? We don't get about me. I know this guy. Yeah, yeah. Are you serious? Yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> no, those are the ones but who feel yeah, this yeah, yeah, yeah. Right? Stop doing that. Stop doing that. But yeah, I get what you mean. But I did you what get you what I was saying? Yes, I did. Is this thing wacky? It is <laughs> wacky. You. Yeah. But now, mm-hmm. this thing about toys, women's G-spot mm-hmm. and women's cleat are... Completely different yeah. as well. Uh-huh. But then again, it's pleasure. Mm-hmm. So tell right? us a bit more about that because bef- women yeah, don't be- talk about it uh, enough. Be- before you say that, could yeah. you say, because this is how I put it yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, with what you're, you're, you're explaining, mm-hmm. is because um, you could call them sex toys or adult toys. Yeah. Uh, I'd call them adult toys because I mean... They're for everyone. Yeah, they're for everyone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm too grown to play with toy cars. Okay. So these yeah. are the toys I Adults. want to play with. So right you now. can't play with toy cars. I mean... Uh, I, that's you him. know I collect that's, right. that's for me I collect toy cards yeah How are you, you play with them boom 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 pee pee yes okay, yeah, yeah. You, I have a whole shelf for them it's, it's, yeah but they're collectors yeah, items they're collectors. not for playing I play with them playing. so to you they're adult toys yeah they're yeah. adult toys and they're toys for both men and women oh, yeah, yeah. to mm-hmm. use because mm-hmm. I've been saying I want this rose and I'm going to get it the, the, rose. Uh-huh. So now, she's here. the question I have yeah. uh, about getting the, the toys I think I'll ask that later. I just let you continue. Mm-hmm. You had a question as yeah, well. Yeah. Or mm-hmm. let me just ask right now. You ask it, yeah. Uh, do babes share? Because if I... <laughs> no, no listen, question. listen. Is this thing Very working? No, listen, question. listen. Because let if, him ask. Let him ask his question. <laughs> if I get the rules, yeah. I'm single. I'll put it in my house. Yeah. Right? And I'd want to try it one time and I'd want to try it again. So now... now With different I, girls yeah, is what you're saying. If... Yeah, see, until I meet my person. No, I don't think so, I'm saying. No, is, it, is it a yeah. rule for sex toys that no, you can't you share say. sex toys? I don't know. New, new person, new sex toy. Yeah, no, yes, do you know, yes. let me say, do you know what they say? Yeah. Do you know, do you know what do you know what lesbians with this? But it's this, plastic. This, this, I, I, was, I was going there actually. Do you know what they say? Yeah. Yeah. Right? Like new if, girl, if you're getting new a new girl, yeah. you get yeah. a new harness. Yeah. That's why I love this. So like they are my biggest customers. Literally, literally, right? Like you know how like, sterilized. that should help you, you understand if your if your babe could wash off 
the ex hey, from that dick. Yeah, yeah, we could. She would buy your new dick. Exactly. God. Exactly. So every new relationship, new so now, yeah. So now <laughs> you want me to buy a new rose each and every yes. single garden yeah. time? Yes. Wait a minute. Who wants to Wait, use? So this brings a very interesting point. So huh? when you go to somebody, and right? Then and then they have partner. they have like sex so toys. Already, yeah. You should just say no. Yeah, because, because chances are they they've new. used them. Yeah, some, but new, wait, but sure. what about disinfecting them? What yeah. I do know, first of all, that's I get that question a lot. Yeah. yeah. From a lesbian's friends, <laughs> the, the, the queer community. Yeah. Because I'll tell you why. No offense to my queer people, mm-hmm. but there's always a thing, they always mention that, oh my God. Queer people, mostly the lesbians, always mm-hmm. have a girlfriend every two months. Oh, right? Like, it's like a thing that goes around. Yeah, no? yeah, yeah. Like, you meet a lesbian today, they're like, oh, let's move yeah, it together. Yeah, they're oh, moving it together. together. Yeah. My point. Mm-hmm. So, the question is, how do I... Can I share a toy? I get that question. Mm-hmm. Number two, can I sign it as a toy? Things like that. Mm-hmm. So, I always say, if you must put a condom on, mm-hmm. the toy. If you oh. must. Okay, yeah. what if, if it's something must. like this now? What is this? How okay. do I put a condom so in this? So, what's your whole thing? Is it that one so, so, that you move like So, this? I use this with my partner because I'm in a long-distance relationship. So, this is long-distance relationship. What is this? Yes, yes. Yes. So, this it, it is can't one be used on, on the panting. Oh. Una baka pantelaina. Uh-huh. Ini magnetic. So, you wear this on your pant. Uh-huh. Shindia panti, uneka ivo, inashikilia. Like, uh-huh. you would move. So, it's basically just there. Uh-huh. Right? Uh-huh. So, someone in Eldoret, in the US, in Kosovo, has the app. <gasps> what? So they just send you vibrations. Yes. I'm sending you positive yes. vibrations. There you go. In so your every, every single time purpose. So for couples who are not together, you know, in the same, yeah, in that's, the same vicinity, yeah. that's the one. or just for fun, <laughs> yeah, just for fun. <laughs> that's so, so, the one. so you have the app on your phone. In doing a So you can get that was, yeah, that one. It's also app control. Mm. So send someone the app, your partner, your girlfriend, whoever it is. Mm-hmm. And then imagine. Hey. Hey. Mm. Imagine now, mm. you know me, I do it like when we're in the same place, just for fun. Hey, see, I I've, want you to I've do seen it videos when of you yeah. being yeah. like, like doing yeah. Like they go out day. together yeah. and then he just decides so to. Again, couples are really spicing things up. Yeah. Because initially I thought toys were just for people who are single. Yeah. Mm. No. Mm. Nowadays we. Couples come in their couples. Yeah. Like most of these toys nowadays are just for couples. To connect you yeah. to connect your person. And, then and I can also see you have games. Boring. Yeah. So now if you don't have someone like to yourself, you buy a toy for every couple. You just say, oh, you, you set you set up. messages on your phone. Yeah. <laughs> alarm. So alarm. Oh, you are just talking like this. When you show up, come with that toy. You're talking like this because you're recently single. Please calm down. Oh, bless you. Calm down. I can use one or two on you. down. Back to my question because I know, like, um, like you said, like people want to be aware of that. This is strong as hell. This one, uh huh. Mm. Okay, come on, we are so easily distracted. I know. So, what hey, tell, tell us about this? Yeah. This is not a microphone and <laughs> orgasms, guys. Focus, listen, to focus. This strength, but, bro. But, but, please take that away from her. Take Except. it from her. She won't focus. Take it from her. Are you hearing? Leave it, leave it. <laughs> but then it's strong. What? Can I ask okay. my question now? Yes, you can. So tell us about Joyce the... is yours like this. <laughs> Shut your mouth. <laughs> <laughs> no, anyway, you so Joyce, Joyce, you are I want to know, know huh? or rather tell women the difference uh, between like G-spot, orgasms, and coming. Because first of all, we are very unaware of a lot of things. The number one thing mm-hmm. is the clitoris. Mm-hmm. Thank God we have that. Thank God. And, and all I get very pissed off and people... Do FGM. I swear FGM is not for me. Getting rid of our. And then, core. Yeah, and then there's those FGMs where it's not just the cleat; they also sew the the lips, the labia, whatever. Yeah, no, no. Oh my god! And most women die on childbirth or must have sex the first time because ayingi, because they only leave like a small cajol just for oh, the no. in the periods and stuff, right? Oh, no. So, the, but the good thing about the cleat now mm-hmm. uh, is that the cleat is not just what you see here. Mm-hmm. Not, not not just that that, that a small cabin you see yeah, on top. Yeah, yeah, not the bean. No. It's a whole thing. Yeah. It mm-hmm. goes actually in all the way in yeah. about okay. seven inches but then the refu oh okay it's about yeah it goes yeah uh-huh. so so that's coming because most, mostly coming is just external like mostly the cleat being rubbed and yeah, yeah, yeah. stimulated mm-hmm. and then my favorite is not when it's, when when the cleat is stimulated in the g-spot so the g-spot is only three four internal, inches yeah. it's pretty close yeah but they see my mona says your dick. So, but at the of the technique, uh-uh. technique matter. Yeah. I'm glad you brought that up. I'm glad she brought that up. 
<laughs> I'm glad she brought that up because she said size. Yeah. And last time we were talking about this thing that was this. Yeah, yeah. micro. Ineza fanya nini? Ineza fanya nini? Micro. No, micro penis is different. This is nano. This is not micro. This is nano. So micro, lazima to me easy. Yeah. Exactly. Thank you. Thank you. So nobody will, no man be left behind. Yeah, yeah. no man. Akim subscribe, Aki. Kai, Akim subscribe. Guy. Akim subscribe. Aki, please. That's it. Is this thing working? Right? Anyway, yeah. so the G-spot mm-hmm. is just, just a couple of inches away from the vaginal wall. Mm-hmm. Go under the rough, rough. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, but they, they, like this finger is enough to get you a G-spot, oh. right? It's somewhere around here. So the G-spot is this rough. Like it feels like oh. here. Mm-hmm. Oh, like the top of your... Uh, uh, <laughs> I'm actually Use your it. tongue to touch the top part of your, of your mouth. That's how the G-spot feels. That's your G-spot. Uh. It feels like that. So the more you stimulate it, Kana vimba, kana vimba. Like it gets more excited. Yeah, yeah. More excited. Like it's just like, because when, when the squatting is coming, because mm-hmm. first of all, please, squatting is not urine. I want to say that. <laughs> yeah, right now. Yeah, see, Makojo. See, Makojo. Yeah. I'll tell you why. And the, the easiest way to know you're not squatting when, when you're having sex, pee before sex. First of all, in case you think you're confused. Because yeah. sometimes it feels like Exactly sensation. like. Because uh, surprisingly, I only squat when I, when I turn 30. What? I never had a squat any before 29 years old, before 30 years old. Because why? I don't know why. I don't, it, I don't know if it's because Did your body of, change or what? Like, Was I don't it know, using a toy? Or? No! Actually, Someone... Actually, actually, you, actually head. Actually, what? A different head guy. Oh, a different one. Not the uh, master. Uh, uh, I remember. <laughs> no wonder I've kept these two head guys mistress. in my life. <laughs> Allah? They're still life. around. Yes. The first. first once I'm going to call you, I'm like, I feel like you're... Headmistress, I keep going to get you. I keep going to get you. When I come a head boy, I'm going to get you to the staff room. So, sir. Take that staff room. This, this guy ate my pussy so good, like seven, eight years ago. Yeah. My kawaii is just how... Me, I just saw him... <laughs> he was like this. Oh, but, even you didn't know what was going on. Yeah, you were like, whoa. He didn't know and I didn't know. And so he was down me and I just saw him like... Like, oh, uh, boom. Like yeah. a whole gash. And I was like, what the... Was you know that? what? Now you've made me think, yeah? yeah? I think one of these toys, maybe we should invent an umbrella. <laughs> <laughs> For umbrella. those specific times when you're... Umbrella. 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 That umbrella. That umbrella. could have drowned. <laughs> 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 a whole 30 years of me. What? Wow. Jesus. I was shocked. But guess what? It wasn't tunnel. It was just a tongue. What? That's my point. At a what is this spot or anything? Guy. The female anatomy is just a very Very special. interesting. It's, it's a very, very interesting, interesting thing. Mm. Okay, I just squatted. Um, what is are this? you okay to mention? Yeah. What is this? Is Let's this talk about that. Okay, okay, that my is, mother uh, might be watching. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's a penis enlargement oil. And it's also an oil that makes you last longer <laughs> if you come too quick. This, this thing. Penis that's what? It. Enlargement oil. Does or? it work? Yes. How many okay. inches? <laughs> we, we work on that one. It's lasting longer. Say, so I haven't got a customer yet telling me, but then if I'm your cousin, how many inches? What do you know? For last, like, if, if you come too quick, it helps with the. That sensation. Yeah, yeah. You would come quicker. You come in, in one so what? Minute. It numbs you or something. Kidogo. Yeah, but you still enjoy the sex. So this this what can make your. You said it can make the the, the, the member bigger. <laughs> yeah. What if you apply too much and you wake up? <laughs> and it's numb completely. No, no. It's a while. Oh, okay, okay. See, yeah, one day or one week or one month or two months. No, like kidogo, kidogo. But mostly, okay. it's most. It was actually meant for uh, having a stronger <clears throat> and mm, stronger hard hard on. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, because okay. we talk about that, about that mm. the other day, how guys, some guys don't get fully hurt. I just so realized we talk sense. about a lot of sex yeah. after this bitch. Oh, yeah, <laughs> no, no, yeah. this episode we needed to. Yeah, we needed yeah. But now I'm just realizing we do speak about a lot of sex. Because you know what? <laughs> we wouldn't be here without yeah. sex. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Sex yeah. didn't go yes. down. A hundred percent. The way our parents always used to uh, tell us, oh my God, all you guys think about is sex. sex. And then they have like 10 children. Yeah, like, it's just like, <laughs> all you were doing was <laughs> thinking about sex. Anyway, <laughs> uh, <laughs> Okay, Woo! Yeah, okay. Before Woo! we wrap up, actually, no, no, no. I wanted mm-hmm. to ask her. Mm-hmm. Um, you know, when you look at like all this, mm-hmm. right? Of course, the first question: How the hell did you get involved in all exactly. this? Exactly. Is this hey, out of your own personal personal? What do I like? Yeah. Zing, zing. Surprise, tell us, no. tell us zing. All of this. Is it? Yeah. Because yeah, yeah. I, I, I left Kenya at eighteen years old to London, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. After high school, that's okay. when I went to London, mm-hmm. and I was mesmerized. You know. 
You know, le kumaka in English we learn English. Compo. Yeah. A mouth agape. It's called agape. A mouth agape. Uh-huh. Yeah. Uh-huh. <laughs> Because I want to learn. I saw toys. I've yeah. never seen a deal in my life. Uh-huh. Imagine you're an 18-year-old girl, born in Kiambu. Imagine. Born in Brother Bengashi. You know what I mean? Miss 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 Miss, you talk about Gashi, but you're not going to. The first time you left, you to London. Yeah. I saw. I went. I was walking through the streets, and I saw. I saw the said sex. So I'm like, you're like what? What a sex? What is that? I fell in love. I was What like, wow. Mean? Anyway, so at 18 years old, I was like, oh my God. Like, well, to me, it was more of an intrigue. Curiosity. Also in curiosity. Mm. Uh, a lot of curiosity. Mm-hmm. And then I ended up having a boyfriend for like five, six years. We never used the term because to me, I thought, See, for, for single, single people, yeah. So when we broke up with my boyfriend then, mm-hmm. um, I got my first ever toy. Mm-hmm. And I was like, oh, I was like, missing. Amazing. <laughs> First thing that before the delay was it like huh or was it like kabla ni delay you cannot compare a toy to the real deal i'm saying this of as course. the vibrating lawyer yes. the sick is better <laughs> i'm sorry or the real like deal. anything to do with all physical the yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, all yeah, the yeah, guys yeah, have all the yeah all of <laughs> Yeah. No, up no, up can... until they make a sex yeah. robot. Oh, man. there you go. Oh I my god. Yeah, I feel like a human you switch yes. off. Oh my god. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah, exactly. And then you can make me food. Good, you can good, get good, good. one yeah, so after each other. Yeah, so this is not replacing yeah. anything. You cannot <laughs> you, replace so anything. You need to replace. So it's yeah. like I was 19 years old. Yeah. Then, no, but, but, but that time mm-hmm. I saw Tracy fell in love with them, but, the, but I didn't know anything about them. But what I say in my mind, I'm like, one day if I ever go back to Kenya yeah. I'm going to start a sex toy or an adult toy business. Oh okay because now you got to, more curious about it yeah. and started learning and about I, the uh-huh. I didn't know anyone who was selling toys in Kenya mm-hmm. then mm-hmm. right? Mm-hmm. So fast forward so me and my then boyfriend broke up mm-hmm. so my second boyfriend that I met after another particular one the one who we broke up after five, six years is not the guy because he was quite violent with me right? Oh, no. He was very he raped me more, more, more than once it was very oh, yeah in London still no. and I remember very uh, he used to kick me out at night like he just wake up I'm like, he's a, he a Kenyan guy actually. Mm. I'm like, what's happening? Like two o'clock in the morning in winter in London, oh right? And I remember telling myself, I thought to God, I will never need a man in my life. <coughs> oh, I'm, I'm soaking up. I never, I, and I said, I never need, need a man. I never want to depend on my man because I was thinking to myself, so I'm living with you mm. because I have nowhere to go. Because okay. it was my last year of uni. I was mm-hmm. doing low, right? Mm-hmm. It was my last year. And I was like, I have somewhere to go. He's my boyfriend. I'm seeing this in the end. Very violent as well. But then again, I said to myself, I will never ever want to be in this situation again. And I never want to ha- sleep with someone, have sex with someone just to please them and to please myself. Because I'm being, ah, when I was 19, mm. I saw toys. Mm. And I want to, when I go back to Kenya, because I knew I only had like money in London before I came back to Kenya for good. Mm. And because I'm being, lazima ni rudi ni fungu ibiashara. So but this, this thing came up from a negative Imagine fact, experience. But now, 11 years later, look at me. <gasps> so did you have an orgasm with him or? Surprisingly, yes. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay. the first like months, couple of months, mm-hmm. yes. Mm-hmm. But then not then, because. <laughs> because it got. <laughs> My my Violent. my ex then and I keep make, making this joke like mm-hmm. we were together for like for six seven years mm-hmm. and never got pregnant it was we say look what a joke withdraw hey <laughs> pull out game pull out game strong pull out game you know you are strong I must say my watch you baby when I go and be I go pull out game poor not my ex before now this guy who was violent right uh, so this new guy that I met yeah you could pull out. Me, 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 I've never used Nini's before. So you didn't know what the condom is or yeah, the contraceptive. Because like, yeah, they yeah. were so good in, uh, at in pulling out. out. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. So mm. I'm like, hey, I'm going to get rid of it. So I'm going to get rid of it. I'm going to get rid of it. Then I got the pill, the injection, whatever it was, or the, or the coil. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And in that particular time, because I didn't even know the the consequences of contraceptive. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because the injection, I don't know, an implant thing that mm. you do not When I was young, you'd be, be called me. I was just seeing him. I, I just see my father. I'm not offense to say this. It's Guy. not bad. Like, I, I did not have any sexual desire whatsoever. So it killed your libido? Yeah. Wait, what? the coil killed no, your libido? No, the, 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 the Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 So, yeah. So, yeah. So, yeah. yeah. So, 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 yeah. Because it was oh. demanding sex. Oh, no. And leave my house at 2 a.m. in the morning. Ah, it's yeah, snowing. Yeah, and yeah, yeah, very crazy. Yeah, 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 But then yeah. I guess when I said, I'm going to be a woman. 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 I, toys are my way out. And oh, they wow. were the way out. Today. So that's, you've been doing it ever since. Yo, man. Yeah. You know, later, I find, this, is, this story is so crazy. Like, mm-hmm. toys are your way out. Yeah. But to the rest of us, they are way in. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh. <laughs> 
Too intimate. Actually, yes. <laughs> <laughs> or the in. Whatever you talk, whatever you, where you think about it. I mean, yeah. in, out, in, in yeah. out. <laughs> yeah. In, in out. out. <laughs> and I kept saying, if, if, if they make me come, mm-hmm. if they give me orgasm, mm-hmm. if, if it doesn't give me a source of income, mm-hmm. I'm leaving it. Guess what? It makes me it come. It does all that. Income. And it makes you money. <laughs> exactly. Bruh, you, you, please you please have a boyfriend yeah. on yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Bob. Yeah. I call plug them Bob. Your battery <laughs> operated boyfriend. Oh, oh wow. Uh, Bob, yeah. 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 You plug, plug your page yeah. real quick. Your yeah. handles, everything. Yes. I'm, I'm really quite excited that yeah. we have this, um, this, this episode and we'll put like her handles there. You can yeah. see them on the page. Mm-hmm. We, cause I, I'm more excited because Maze, Valentine's Day Wednesday <laughs> and guys had pressure and they didn't know what they that needed to so get cool. was to get themselves uh, situated. Mm-hmm. Yeah. In fact, which, which one has been your favorite? Because there's even, I'm seeing so there's many. intimacy cards here. This there's for me seems like, love language. I think this one I have to be in love. Like, so I, cause I think, so I can let you tie me up. <laughs> bruh. Yeah. <laughs> okay, <laughs> okay, I'm 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 I can I can that joke, I can know, I can know. I love you. You don't know, and then you know, and then now you are you're locked up. Because I've seen, I mean, I've watched movies. Not blue movies, movies that were American. Yeah. Uh, no, the thing because I like what, what what you're holding the cards as well. Mm-hmm. So couples, not everyone likes using toys, and it's okay. Yeah, yeah. Like if, if it's much, it's quite hard for you to introduce uh, sex no. toys or mm-hmm. adult toys to a relationship. There's some cards, some love, love language cards, sex position. Come here, black. I think it has 52 different sex positions. That's 52 weeks, I think. Let me see. Hey, hey, hey. 50 this is 50. What? There you 50 go. positions what? of exactly. bonding. Wait, 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 so come on. Oh, see, you're going to get a... You're going to get a bonding. You're going to get a sex. That one. Sex like, positions. F- like spice things up. Oh, it says you, sex position cards. Yeah. yeah. A might, year of sex. Damn. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. You you you, you might not want to just we, introduce toys to your relationship yeah. or your marriage, yeah. but you want to spice something things else. Up. Yeah. You, now, I think Jaka. the big question here would be, because mm-hmm. I brought it back to Africa, like, you know, what challenges people would have mentally yeah. in seeing some of these mm-hmm. and even here mm-hmm. <laughs> and see V over there I'm just clear where <laughs> <laughs> what do I know about sex <laughs> yeah <laughs> let me just just go around the room would you would you get a sex toy good. you would yeah after, after this conversation after yeah would you yeah, get it okay. after after now or before yeah before good. before did you know much about sex toys all right there you go you before you would oh, get you, would have, oh, have you, right, Mungai, you know we need to Mungai, we, we need, need to, to talk, talk. <laughs> <laughs> you know you know it's always the quiet ones yeah, yeah, yeah. I told you I told yeah, you it's always the, the quiet ones I love you I don't say a word <laughs> <laughs> so you guys you. One thing. this was the best seller uh-huh. Tommy Corona the fa- this is the famous rose. me this, this is the one I want wait <laughs> this is the famous is it like this one the same thing so Uzuri this, this is the rose. Or that this is the rose. This is the rose. Let me start. Uh, this okay. is the first ever rose. Oh, it was the original. In, no, no, but it's not like a flower. Uh-huh. And this is the original. Rose. So, what normally happens is after oh. that, they came now extended. You know what I mean? Same thing, you see? Oh, waka. Mm. So that's how you can use this, you can use this. Exactly. Eh, eh, kakwa 2.0. 2.0. Uh-huh. So, it's not like a new one. So, but uh-huh. initially, uh-huh. but to date, the rabbit vibrator is it's the highest selling. In case so, you're wondering, this one. Pink. Yeah. That's a rabbit. Oh, this so one. A rabbit yeah. is both just just like this one. and clean. Can you stop <laughs> telling <laughs> people what yours looks like? Stop yeah. telling people what yours yeah. looks like. Yeah. Stop yeah. telling people what yours looks like. That one is not circumcised. Oh, Okay, this show. I'm tired. Exactly. Exactly. Oh. <laughs> See, 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 see. See. No, no, but guys, oh my now, God. That, now that yeah. we've talked about, because all these concepts, yeah. they come from European or Eurocentric yeah. or Asian centric. So. No, right? yeah, you know, centric. Because so so this is where they come from. Mm. But the question would be, and I'd love to hear from the audience in the comment section, have you ever heard about a sex toy that's African? Right? Because when you think about sex toys or sex, sexual pleasure, people think that it must have come from Mm-mm. it's Europeans. Mm. Fun fact. It was first invented here. Mm-hmm. No. The, <laughs> one of the oldest dildos on the continent mm-hmm. 
is mm. in Egypt. Uh-huh. Right? They used to they used to Cut. use because even condoms they had condoms back True. in the day. They like use uh, skin. 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 no no the skin. intestine yeah. the intestine oh, good. Yeah. 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 right what you now use as mutura yeah. that would be a goddamn <laughs> condom. <laughs> Okay. Okay. <laughs> yes. Um but there was also like uh, sticks and 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 mm, stones, stones will and break yeah. my bones mm. but I will come. Yeah, so <laughs> so just put it off. I'd love to off. hear okay. from you in your different African countries if you've ever heard of dildos. In fact, I'm going to push Kenyans. Mm-hmm. Check what their Kenyan dildos. Did your community have a dildo or anything to create pleasure for sex. sex. Yes. And not just your fingers. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we're not talking about that. Everyone yeah. has those. No, yeah. <laughs> so let us know in the comments. <laughs> Thanks, <laughs> guys. <laughs> Make sure you follow her on G Sport Kenya. <laughs> Buy something for your peoples, right? Ikibamba sana wapi? Nduru! Ikibamba sana wapi nduru? Oh, sorry. Ikibamba sana wapi nduru? Oh, that reminds me, you guys, can I just plug this, mm-hmm. did you plug? Yes. I lost my old Instagram account, mm-hmm. the vibrating lawyer. Now I'm called the, the vibrating lawyer. How so my account was v? closed. So the, the, thy, thus, no, the, <laughs> thou, thus, so C- shoot. T-H-E-E. Okay. Uh-huh. Cool. Yeah. V. Yeah. Find the vibrator. V, uh, vibrating Find lawyer. thy vibrator. Mm-hmm. At V no, vibrating lawyer. Oh, just yeah. podcast. And bring it thus yeah. forth. <laughs> Thank you. Nivo. Sorry, Meisha. Mm. So, you can see what you can do. Yeah, you can see what you Do you know, last year, I actually got a client sending me flowers. What? A bottle of champagne. Oh, you can see what you can do. Oh, you can see what you can do. Oh, my God, Bev. The best orgasm ever. I came. I've never come like that. It's either truth or dare or a roll dice. So, I'll tell you what the dice says. Subscribe. Chow! Chow! Chow!